What's up guys, welcome to Supercars in London. How are you doing? And I hope that you are enjoying the weekend. We have got some half decent news. The weather has calmed down, thank God. Uh, there's still some low clouds about, but I think the wind has died down. Apparently the hurricane is moving out to sea, which is good news. Um, today is gonna be a bit of a chill day. I'm gonna go down, grab some food, and then head over towards NYC and actually do Times Square. So the end of yesterday's video, <laughs> I was still like half asleep and it was so early in the morning that I thought that my camera had broken. However, I just was charging my battery and I didn't put it into my camera so that it, it was never gonna turn on without the battery. So that's good news as well. Um, and I'm completely shattered. It was a really, really long day, quite a late evening yesterday. And then I woke up again very, very early. And I just heard the door. So, today we're going to try and nail some of the touristy things in New York as well as try and get to um, Manhattan motor cars. My phone's just buzzed, so I um, lost um, concentration. But yeah, we're going to go to Manhattan motor cars and try and check out some supercars there um, and try and grab some proper American food. So, let's go. I am so tired. Porsche 918 there. We will go and check it out inside. We've got the new GT3 RS there as well, which I'm going to definitely check out. But we're here to see Manhattan Motor Cars, which is next to Porsche. I... So we're going to, well, check out. There's a Porsche there. Boxster, but still. Oh look, Lamborghini Manhattan. I have no idea how to get in though, but I want to go here. It's bad that you have to come to New York and go to showrooms to see these sorts of cars because you're never going to see them out there. We've got an Aventador Roadster, look at this Gallardo. Look at these, look at these super legera pipes, but we've got a red engine bay there, red brake calipers, and red wing mirrors. What do you guys think of this spec? Interesting. Camera doesn't really pick it up. Oh, it's got red interior, red and black interior, but you can't really see it. That's tight. Can't come to a supercar dealership and not have a Ford GT. The R8 V8 and a 458 with a wing, which is interesting. Yeah. 
This is by far my favorite section of Manhattan Motors, the Lamborghini section. We've made it to Times Square and this place is insane. Kind of trumps Piccadilly Circus in London by quite some distance. Look at it. crazy to be here, a place where I've driven so many times on Grand Theft Auto 4, straight through Times Square, in an infernus, going through red lights, classic New York. So we made it to Central Park, a park in the middle of one of the busiest cities in the world. One of the tallest cities, that's for sure. The buildings literally tower over you. It's so cool here. My battery, unfortunately, is running out, which is annoying. So hopefully we can get some more of Central Park in. Look how tall that is. Look, I can touch the top actually, but this is insane. So surreal to be here, but uh, this is awesome. Right, we're going to try and walk up these rocks to see the skyline. <laughs> Even though the clouds are basically covering it. Let's see how slippery these are. It's windy. Very windy. Gucci Fiat 500 and Macy's off to the left and some sirens down there.
It is the final day, and what a day I had yesterday, being able to see Times Square, and all of the stuff you've just seen in the vlog. And the cool thing is, I got back from yesterday, and this was here. Now, if you don't know Cake Boss, it's a world-famous uh, TV show about, um, well, the Cake Boss, the guy that is famous for making cakes, and he owns Carlos Bakery, which um, the W. Hoboken have kindly sent me some cookies. So that's going to be my breakfast today when I'm editing this video. So um, I'm going to quickly sign off with the beautiful view because it's really clear outside. I'm not sure how windy it is. I'm going to have to have a look at the trees, but it doesn't look windy at all. Trees aren't really moving. Well, the flag is. But it's very, very clear this morning, which is a good thing. Today, we're going to be going over there. Whether we go via ferry or how we get there, it is unknown. But we're going to be going to Freedom Tower today, so that's going to be amazing. And as a final day, probably the best place to go in New York. So thank you for watching. I'm still half asleep. Um, and thank you for tuning in, as always, to... Um, well, these are very travelly vlogs today, uh, the, over the last three or four days. Um, and it's going to be quickly moving back to supercars when I get back to the UK. Whilst you're watching this, it's going to be 5pm in the UK. I'm, I'm probably going to be over there actually. I'm going to be over there. And then basically what I'm going to be doing is my flight's at half past 10 in the evening here and I get back at half past 10 in the morning in England because of the time difference jump. Um, I'm going to get back at half 10. I'm going to need to edit and upload today's vlog which I'm not yet filmed. Confusing myself, thanks for watching, and I will see you tomorrow, guys. Oh, yes. So, yeah. <laughs>